Over the four-day summit, technology demonstrations have taken centre stage, highlighting how innovations can help meet the UN's goals from quality education to improved health. Here's a very simple example on this demo stage. Nearly 300 million people are blind worldwide and 60% do not graduate from university and face high rates of unemployment and social exclusion. But it doesn't need to be that way. Annie Root revealed one of the most exciting new projects in the field, a virtual guide dog on a mobile phone providing real-time description of your surroundings. Hello, Rinda. Thanks for calling Ira. This is Joshua. What would you like to do today? It looks like behind a bunch of people is some sort of car. Ira connects a blind person who has a smartphone or a smart glass, remote streams their view over to a remote professionally trained agent who can look at the world, understand it and describe it. And once the description comes back to the blind person, they can go and do amazing things, all the way from ordinary to extraordinary. When we talk of AI, we often think about robots or new gadgets. Well, right now, I'm in the art corner. So this is a totally different look at AI. For more on this, here's Christian. Through art, uh, we can um, bring these topics into the world of culture and uh, inspire people to come on board and help us dream up ideas how AI can be used for, for the sustainable development goals. All of this Berlin-based artwork is AI-inspired and the artists say it fits into the UN's SDG's aims of expanding learning systems and human creativity.